Hey guys, Nemesis Z here, bringing you the Super Flat Water World, and today we are currently working on the volcano a little bit. In the lines, this is going to be episode 99. I do have something else planned for episode 100, and then, you know, working on this, but this is one of those projects that's been taking a while, so. Realize right now. Mine it out just a little bit to get a uh, like an archway in kind of thing. <clears throat> Otherwise, <clears throat> sorry. Otherwise, yeah, I've just been uh, working on this, digging it out, digging all the cobble out, trying to basically just update the lighting, get the all the lighting glitches out. So that way I can get frames, that kind of thing. Uh, but it's 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 one of those things that's kind of hard because of so many uh, so much cobble. I mean, it's just it's a lot. So either wise, it's a lot easier than all the uh, obsidian I had to mine out. That's for sure. But it's just, it's taken me a while. Otherwise, I mean, we are stats be looking like almost 3 million netherrack. I haven't, well, I've touched a little bit of netherrack. I haven't done any in a while, but 125, you know, almost 126,000 blocks of obsidian. And then the cobble is starting to rack up so it's one of those things that's that's gonna have a lot of extra blocks otherwise I've already been putting the cobble away in the uh the, like the the mass storage area so otherwise right now episode might be a little short because well it's it's hot and we're getting, you know, 100 and some odd degree weather. And it's just not a fun thing. More up. So, I mean, it's just one of those things where 100 degree weather is not a fun thing. Because triple digits is just, ugh. Just not a fan of heat. I think it, well, I used to be. I mean, I used to be able to withstand heat like it was nothing, but now I just can't. I can withstand cold like it's nothing. But heat, on the other hand, is just like my arch enemy. Because otherwise, I think it kind of goes back to uh, one of the times of uh, being at the local, like, I wouldn't. Well like flea market and we're out there visiting friends because we used to sell we me and my parents used to have a booth out there so I was just when I was younger we went out there and uh to go see who was still out there and you know it was a nice hot day so it was like 90 degrees or better and uh so basically we're we hit one of the snack bars it's like, oh, yeah, let's get something to drink, you know, because it's hot. And sitting there, you know, been walking on hot black, just because they don't even have it wasn't even pay, it wasn't pavement. Is it? Well, it's uh, asphalt. Is basically what they had, just full on asphalt. So it's like, oh, what, what do you want to drink? It's like, oh, it doesn't matter. It's like, oh, I'll get it, you know, like an icy or something like that. And so sitting there. All of a sudden, I'm just, I lose my sight. I'm like, wait, uh, I can't see. So, like, I got that overheated to basically, I lost my eyesight for a little bit. And then pounded an icy, like, two bottles of water real quick. Came back. Obviously, I probably shouldn't have chugged it real quick. But, I mean, it's, it, it, I got my vision back and all that. It's just one of those things where it's, it's a little scary, but uh, 
this this will probably do. Otherwise, I have I already did um, some edit. Ugh, come on, go up over some editing of the caldera of up here. So basically, I got it ready for lava and other stuff. Obviously, my frames are gonna go away, but I left areas for to leave some lava pools. Probably gonna have other spots down there somewhere. Do the same thing, just make some lava pool areas. And then I have over by the portal another uh, hole that I made. So basically, there's gonna be a few tunnels leading into the volcano because basically it's going to be multi-layer volcano kind of thing like basically outside is going to be different from the inside so wow the frames but yeah that's what that's why I'm clearing all that out because I mean if I look away from pretty much all the the majority of the cobble my frames are good so otherwise I still got multiple layers to go I think I got 10 more layers if I clear out every six cobble and leave the seventh one as a floor and then basically I'm putting in the uh, the blocks so all these missing holes this was floor number seven. These would all be getting filled back in with cobble. So it's kind of a pain when you're crouching most of the time, trying not to fall in the holes because some of them are, you know, too too tall or too high or whatever. So yeah, I threw a beacon in here, marked out where the they are. So I mean, that's the the floor, but I'm gonna clear out all that from you know every all the sides that way then I can start landscaping the insides otherwise um, let's see what else let's just go up top uh, I want to add a couple more like tunnels I want like I don't know three maybe because I got one at, I think I want one towards the top yeah I do One towards the top might be a little smaller because it's going to be access for redstone stuff. Because basically, I plan on putting, um, gotta look it up, but I want to put in some TNT launchers and Spencer's stuff. So, either I've been working on this floor, either I, I changed it up instead of just going the whole layers. Just doing the bottom two and then refilling all the the holes and torching it off. You know, all these layers I did top to bottom, top to bottom, you know, just chunks at a time or whatever. You know, as I mean, since these are the smaller floors, they're not so bad, but as soon as I start going down, it starts getting heavier and heavier. So, as I added this floor earlier. I wanted uh, stuff. Otherwise, the cobble floors, basically where the dispenser is going to be, so that's that floor right there. So let's. Uh, rain, of course. So let's go right here. So I guess tap into this floor. Done that quite a bit. I accidentally pearl. But now at least we're at the beacon. Mine this up a little faster. See the wise, I mean like I said, I've just been slowly working on this. Let's that there. Take that out. I know 
I just dug some of that out, but there. So I'm probably gonna have it hidden behind lava, maybe. And basically, all I have to do is enter pearl in. You know, I've been closing some of this off too, because I've noticed that it'll change lights. So trying to not keep all the weird glitchy light blocks or whatever because I'm hoping most of it's fixed Let's see what else oh yeah I got this stuff here which is go straight down oh, I don't have any more pearls okay good Utilize. Got my three shulker boxes of magma blocks that I'm going to use, and then all my concrete powder that I made. Uh, basically, with this stuff, I was planning on going around the outside edges of the volcano itself in the water. Uh, putting it down it was I think I think the powder and the concrete form are going to be like uh, call it the like uh, I don't know, the lava flow, like the dried lava flow. So the, I think that the powder part might be the dried lava flow. Because otherwise this is going to be the, the stuff that meets the water kind of thing. I don't know. It's one of those things where i got to do a lot of, I think, work. I always getting spiders on the outside, but... I don't know, I gotta figure out what I really wanna do with a lot of this, cause I mean, I got all those magma blocks I wanna do too. And I already know that's not enough magma blocks for what I wanna do. Cause otherwise it's only a ch double chest and a half. So. Let's see, we're gonna, uh, what else can we do today? Cause like I said, I'm trying to not cook. So right now they because we got swamp cooler. I got it currently turned off. Um, otherwise it would be loud as super loud and just annoying. Otherwise, I mean, I need lava buckets. But I don't want to start just putting lava in just yet. I gotta kind of just go with the flow kind of thing. Maybe I'll just do this for now. But sleep. Get rid of the rain, get rid of the bombs, the mobs. Yeah, I also had another tooth uh, worked on since the last time we talked, too. Got a, uh, uh, not a crown, a uh, temporary filling. Uh, first couple days, I still taste it if I if, if I let it go, um, like a mint taste to it. It's because it's, it's supposed to be a medicated temporary filling. Because you're sitting there, it's like, oh yeah, maybe we do, you know, if it's too close, we'll do a root canal. I'm like, ha, ha, that'd be another tooth you're pulling, bud. It's like, not not because you know it'll be may be painful because um, root canals are expensive I'm not down for expensive you know dental work not a millionaire not made of money I mean maybe some point in time when I am but at this p moment in time I'm not so I was always thinking you know it's would be like my grandparents because when they were in their 40s, uh, I don't I don't know what it was. It, 
he decided to get all his teeth pulled, and then my grandma follows suit because I think it's you know money at the time or something like that. So they said screw it, or I guess just that many tooth problems, and yeah, they just said all right, let's just do that route, and they just went full false teeth. So like in a way, it's cheaper. Get it all done. Get the get the dentures and you're good to go. So I mean, it's it's a thought, but then it's like eh, I don't want to be like you know in my thirties and I got dentures. But you know they got those implant teeth or whatever. They pull everything and screw them in or whatever into your jaw. Those aren't bad. I mean, neat idea, but. It's probably like ten thousand dollars or better. It's like no, don't have that kind of money either. It's like oh, you suck. No, I really want that. We're getting it. Yeah, I was a little longer down here. I'll just do some of this. Uh, it's going to be dark. I guess just don't go over too far. I don't have anything on me. Yeah, see all those light things? Part of that. It's like I tried fixing some of it earlier, but it just was still glitchy. There it is. Make a couple. But, yeah, um. Let's see. Don't really have any tales from this. from work at the moment. It's kind of weird. All of a sudden, gray, and then there's black. I'm not going to be looking from the bottom of it too much. So, because I thought about placing like a layer of cobble underneath, but that's that's a lot. Or I go in and I rip all all the stone and then place down lava again, just to try to get it to update. Because I really don't want lots of you know those light glitches even underneath so let's say I would do this and be back with you guys but like I said the heat is a factor So, I think I'm going to cut the episode here, guys. I'm not going to... I don't think I'm going to make it a real... I think it'll be like 99.1 or something like that. It'll be like a two-part episode. Because hopefully I can get something like do you know do some real work and then hopefully uh, the heat will go away It'll, you know won't be hot and I don't have to run the AC so so yeah come on so yeah guys that's gonna do it for today sorry about the shorter episode and no real work um but yeah until next time guys leave a like comment subscribe all that fun stuff be safe out there and see you in the next one bye guys